Hello and welcome to the dwelling place of Detheus. My name is Detheus, but you can call me John, and today we're going to play an indie game on Steam called Moirai, or Moirai, or however you pronounce it. I'm not really sure. Um, this is a free-to-play indie game on Steam right now, and it has overwhelmingly positive reviews, and I mean overwhelmingly, like, majority of the people playing this game fucking love it for some reason, and it's really short, apparently, and it's free, like I said, and, uh, yeah, it's apparently kind of like an indie horror game, actually, and, uh, we gotta find some missing lady or something, and apparently it gets pretty interesting. So let's just press space to start, like it says, and just jump right into it and see what happens. Alright. Okay, so this is weird. I don't have to use my mouse at all. Just using WASD to turn. D A W S, obviously. Right, let's talk to this uh, fine looking priest over here. My prayers go out to the poor Ju to, to poor Julia. It's been a year since her husband has passed. She hasn't been seen all day. I imagine she is grieving. Do you mind visiting her at her home? It's the house to the right as you leave town. Okay. Let's talk to the lady over here. Talk to mother. Did you hear about the boy? Julia lost her son in the cave shortly after her husband died. Poor Julia. I would never let my boys out of my sight. Hey there, little kid. Let's just talk to him. Need to stay close to Mama, otherwise she'll worry that we've run off. Oh, okay. Can I go into these houses? Yeah, I can, but what's the point? Talk to girl. Sometimes Daddy lets us pat the sheep on the head. They're so soft. Cool. So this might be Julia's house, I think. Look at the bookshelf. There's a picture of a sh on the shelf of a wife, husband, and a young boy. I wonder where they are. Okay, well, this is apparently her house. Um, so. Who knows? Let's just fucking leave. Hey, let's do this. Let's, uh, let's go outside here. Go to the farm. Okay. What, what was that? Read signpost. Farm. Simple as that. Poke sheep. <coughs> wow, it actually made a noise. That's pretty actually cool. Open barn door. The barn door is locked. Oh no. Oh uh, nah. Okay. Let's. Oh, hello, sir. Talk to the lumberjack. My brother and I were chopping wood when. We heard moans coming from the cave. My brother went in to investigate. He should have been back by now. I'm worried. Can you check on him? There's a lantern behind you on that stump. Sure. Picked up the lantern on the stump. Can I pick up the axe? No, I can't apparently. Go to cave. Alright. Hey you! Come over here! Did my brother send you? Bless him. The bones are coming from further down. I'd go in, but my sight's no good. You should take this knife. Who knows? You may need it. Oh. So... Can I actually use this knife? Oh, I'll find out. Alright, so we're in a cave now. Um... And we're still investigating the missing person, Julia. And remember, her uh, her husband and her son. Well, her husband died, and I think her son went missing. Or died, too. I'm not really sure. I don't remember. I literally just learned about it, too. I don't know why I don't remember. But... Uh, ooh. What do we got here? Is that a rat? What is this? 
Look at tools. There's some tools leaning against the wall. It looks as though they've been used to mark carvings onto the wall. Looks like, uh, some tallies or whatever. There's a lot of them, too, so... Look at book. There's a book on top of the pedestal. It's labeled, Farmers. There's a list of names inside. Righteous. Dance. Comb. Dylan's. How eerie. Okay, so I guess there's nothing here. Let's go back and, uh... Let's go find... Go down one of the other corridors in this cave. Nope, can't go that way. This reminds me of, like, when I was playing, like, Arena for a little bit. Because, you know, if you've ever played, like, Elder Scrolls Arena or Daggerfall, you start in, like, a dungeon. And, uh... Whoa. What the fuck was that? Oh, Jesus! Hello? A farmer approaches. Why do you have blood on your overalls? Why do you have a knife? I heard moans. What have you done? Let them pass. Attack. Why do you have blood on your overalls? Kill! Why do you have a knife? What? I heard moans. What have you done? Why? Let them pass. All right, I will let you go. I'm wondering if I shouldn't have let him go. But you know what? Fuck it. We'll find out. We'll find out if we should have or not. Jesus, this is a... F it's kind of a weird game, actually. It's just... Okay. Oh, Jesus! Please help me, I am in a lot of pain. I came here to end my life. My name is Julia and I want to see my child and husband in heaven. My husband was a miner in these caves. He spent days mining for gold and then one day he found something. He found a golden nugget. I thought we could retire and be comfortable for the rest of our lives, but he didn't trust me. He buried the golden nugget to the spite me. Then he disappeared. Everyone in the town heard about our good fortune. They thought I was rich. I was so ashamed that I couldn't tell them the truth. One day my son wandered into the cave and he wanted to find his daddy. He wanted to make everything better. But he never came out of that cave. I went to look for him, but I couldn't find him. Now it's too late. Now I have nobody. Will you help me? Will you help me in my li in my life? Jesus Christ. This is a little heavy, uh... No, I'm going to get help. Then leave me, you coward. Oh, j Jesus. Sorry, I... Lady. I feel like I keep hearing, like, breathing. Alright, we're gonna go get help. Because... Fucking... Oh, Jesus Christ. That I don't know why that just scared me. A farmer approaches. Why do you have blood on your overalls? What? Why do you have a knife? Why? I heard moans. What have you done? Oh, wait a second. Nothing. Let's see what will happen to you. And that is where the story shall end, at least for now. It is up to the next player of this game to choose your fate. Just as you chose for the previous player. Enter your first name. John. Enter your email address. 
Uh, we'll, we'll do that later. You will be emailed about your fate. Thank you for playing. Press space to submit your details. What? What? Okay, what? The f... Alright, this game has me scratching my head and begging for answers. So I'm gonna play it one more time and just see what the fuck happens, because... This is very interesting. Let's do this. Alright, yeah, let's just talk to the people again. Praise the Lord. Uh, this time, let's check all the cabins if we can. Okay. Hello, girl. My uncle and dad are out chopping wood to keep us warm in the winter. They should be ha they should be home soon. Okay. Cool. Um, let's just check all these cabins. Talk to the boy. I heard there is a gold in the cave, but I'm too scared to enter. They say there's a little boy that haunts over your shoulder. Cool. Okay. Interesting. All right, let's check this one. Oh, hello. Hello, sir. Talk to the chef. It looks like a lovely day outside. You should head out to the farm if you get the chance. Spend some time with the animals. I don't know why I just gave him like that weird accent, but he's a chef, so why not? All right. Um. This is the the ladies' house cabin thingy. All right, let's just let's just do this all over again. Let's let's take different choices this time. Um, yeah, let's do this. Yo, what's up, man? Just, uh, I'm gonna grab you. Excuse me. Let's let me grab my fucking lantern here. Let's just get into the cave. Hey, you come over here. Yeah, I can't go on. Just take this knife. All right. So, yeah, this game is fucking weird, dude. Let's, um, wait a second. Let's go back to the room with the book. Which I believe is this way. There's a book on top of the pedestal, it is land with farmers, there's a list of names inside. Holy shit! There's my fucking name! Okay! This is weird. This is a weird game. You know what, this time I'm gonna make different choices. And... <sighs> Alright. Okay. A farmer approaches. Why do you have blood on your overalls? What? Why do you have a knife? Why? Wait a second. I heard moans. What have you done? Nothing. <gasps> Attack them! I killed them! There is a name on the farmer's overalls. John. Attack them! I killed them! There is a name on the farmer's overalls. John. What have I done? I've killed myself. Holy shit. Okay. Alright, lady. Yes. This time I will help you. Yes, yes, I understand. Yes, close your eyes. Please, end it quickly. 
Stab. She's dead. Let's let's check her body again if I can. Nope, can't. Okay, so Oh my god, dude. <laughs> Hello. A farmer approaches. Why do you have blood on your overalls? Wouldn't you like to know? Why do you have a knife? Because I heard moans. What have you done? Red Ram! Let me see what will happen to you. And that is where the story shall end, at least for now. It is up to the next player of the game to choose your fate just as you chose for the previous player. Dethius. Alright. That was Moirai, or Moirai, or however you pronounce it. And holy shit, this is a. F this is actually a really cool game. I mean, it was really, really fucking short. But, I mean. It's got some. It's got some cool things going on in this game. I mean, pretty much deciding the fate of the player who played this before you is pretty awesome. And then going through, like, for example, when I did it twice, I was able to see myself, and I killed my, I killed myself. And now I'm going to get an email that t saying that I killed myself, and blah, blah, blah. And pretty interesting. Um... So yeah, I'm gonna say definitely check out this game. It's it's free on Steam. It doesn't take very long to do. Um, it's pretty interesting. I mean, you've basically seen the whole game in this video. Um, and yeah, this this was actually a really cool game. I'm really really glad that I checked this out. Um, and anyways. Um, like and favorite if you enjoyed this. Subscribe to check out future and past videos. And stay tuned for whatever else I'm making in the near future. And hopefully it's the near future. I want to get back into the swing of things and start uploading more videos. But until then, I'll catch you guys later. Goodbye.